I flew to London for lunch and flew home. That was the day before yesterday. Right now, I should be riding horses in Zambia. And I'm not. Here's what happened. I was supposed to go to Zambia. So I took the red eye to London on British Airways. Got to London, met up with my friend Rona. We went to Windsor and walked around the castle. Went to lunch, had some fish and chips. It was fabulous. It was like a 12-hour layover before I flew to Johannesburg. I was supposed to take the red eye to Johannesburg. And then up to Zambia. I show back up at Heathrow, wait and wait. My flight gets delayed. And the flight gets canceled. British Airways had mechanical issues with their flight. And it was one of those big, like, double-decker, triple-seven planes. Don't get me wrong, I would rather spend the night in London than, uh, you know, crash in the Kalahari Desert. So thanks. By now, I know that not only have I missed my flight to Zambia, because Zambia is so remote, and there's only one flight a day, I would miss my safari when I finally got there. It would be like two days late, so it's Monday morning. I still would not be there. I wouldn't be there till tonight. So I would have missed the first two days of safari. The safari is off the grid. <gasps> there's no roads. There's no Wi-Fi. There's no power. It's not like you're at a resort and you just go out for daily game drives. You're on a horse. It's you're totally off the grid, which is awesome, which is why I do it. They can't just drive me out and like find the safari in the bush. I told British Airways this. I was like, I've missed my vacation. They sent me back to Miami home by Saturday night. Let this be a lesson to all of you. Always get the travel insurance. 